Hello and welcome to my studio. This week I am in my French studio in northern France and I am showing you what I've been up to for the previous week with um, a couple of paintings, one that I finished and one that you see behind me um, that I've just started this week. I'm Helen, Helen Alice Johnson artist and each week if you uh, follow my videos you'll see that I do uh, video of my studio and also a video of my garden series and basically I visit a garden each week and that informs my paintings um, which you then see in my studio. This week it is a garden from long ago, uh, Lassie Le Chateau, I've seen it two or three times this year and I've finally started the painting so let's go and have a look. So this painting here that you see is now finished, it's called Purple Delight which is the common name for the Agapanthus and I thought it was a really lovely title because there's quite a lot of purple in it. It's based on an Oxford garden of a, a good friend of ours and um, I'm quite pleased with the finished result. You'll see that it was a triptych, it's now a diptych, but I think it works better that way. It was originally meant to be a diptych. And then here you can see that this is my uh, sketchbook, so this is me starting the medieval garden I'll put some other photos on there of previous sketches in my sketchbook of the medieval garden. Um, but basically I use a variety of materials which I then put into a sketch in my sketchbook and it's very kind of loose. It may well turn out to be quite close to the sketch. It may turn out to be completely different. Um, I then map that original uh, or kind of first study, if you like, onto um, a canvas. In this case, I'm using two canvases and then begin to just plot out the, the basic colour scheme within that. You can see that there is based on a combination of a sunflower, that pattern, a combination of a sunflower and another um, wispy kind of grass type flower that again, I'll put that as an inlay so you'll be able to see what that looks like. Um, which I use as just a kind of reference point, really. Uh, other shapes that are in this painting so far, there's the triangles um, and the arches, which both are really evident in the medieval garden. Uh, it's got these lovely arches that I think are made out of beech. They certainly go orange in winter. And also then it has these kind of cone, um, is it like box or something like that? There's some sort of bo uh, box. Uh, cone shaped things in the middle. See I'm just building up the colours here uh, to um, create that sort of vibrancy. This I wanted to show you because I have um, used a paint which is the darker colour and then on top of wet paint I have used a Sennelier um, oil pastel uh, in the pink which gives it uh, that kind of quality of it sort of smudges the one behind that sits on top, makes quite a nice mark. Long way to go before this is finished, um, but that's where I've got to so far this week. And um, we'll see how it develops. So there you go, a whistle stop tour of this week's activities. One painting finished, another one on the way. Uh, thanks ever so much for watching. I hope to see you in a garden somewhere tomorrow and um, please continue to um, watch my videos on my website www.helenalicejohnsonartist.com um, also on youtube and if you don't already please follow me on instagram thanks again